And that's a fairly big emotion for many parents, isn't it? How many of you are really, really concerned for the safety and welfare of your child? Quite a few. All right, so big emotion. That, that you need to allow yourself to feel that, right? Because if you don't feel that, sooner or later you're going to create a quite intense event where that may occur. So you need to allow yourself to feel it now. So if you feel that, release it. Cry about it, release it. Your children are safe, remember, because of your soul condition. So if you know that your soul condition isn't good enough to save them, then start praying to God about that. Does that make sense? Talk to God about giving our child extra protection. Yeah. Talk to God about giving our child extra protection while I'm dealing with this emotion. Does that make sense? And so there's many times where we can't clear the emotion immediately as a parent. But we can, we can deal with a lot of the emotion. But we can also pray for God's protection of the child while we're dealing with the emotion. And God actually assigns celestial spirits to do that when we pray for that to occur. Thank you. As a parent, I could um, work my free will and I could just go and stand over there so that I knew I could see him without actually interrupting with what he wanted to do. You've actually still, broken. I'm still breaking my still emotional. Breaking. Yep. Yeah, because what you're doing is you're avoiding your own emotion about it. By actually going and making sure that they're safe, you're actually now at that point avoiding your own emotion. And in fact, what you're doing is not dealing with the causal emotion of why he's out there triggering you in the first place. Does that make sense? So deal with the emotion. Like really focus on dealing with the emotion in every single interaction with your children. Because that changes it straight away. I can, later on I'll be giving you lots of examples where I've done this with parents while I've been in the car with them and all sorts of things. And you'll see, you'll see how it works. The key is to trust that. And you can pray for the protection of the child while you're dealing with this emotion. So you can long to God to protect the child. I need to just deal with this emotion and go into the emotion.